So guys, so back with another video. I was just checking out this other YouTuber's video um, of his game collections. So I decided I've been wanting to do this for a long time, but now I've decided to do this the way back. Okay. So um, right now the the camera is charging. So I have to work with this crappy thing, so bear with me. I know it's probably lagging right now. I'm not for sure. It's, I'm like looking at myself at the same time. So here's my Nintendo Wii game collection. So we're already 50 seconds into this video, so let's start it. Spider Man 3. Um, it was a pretty cool game. I really enjoy Spider Man 3. I definitely need to go back and play in the Spider Man series. Um, you know, they got really cool games from Spider Man because I'm now realizing that. But Spider Man 3 is a great game. Um, I don't know if you can still find it, but if you can find it, I say probably rent it, but it is a pretty cool game. This game totally sucks. That is, we play. It just sucks. It, it's not a fun game. Um, I mean, I really can't find anyone who likes it. Lego Indiana Jones Original Adventures. I know I show that I have it on 360. That's because it came with two games, and then I was younger, so I wanted Kung Fu Panda, so I just got both of them. But Lego Indiana Jones Original Adventures. It was a pretty okay, easy game, and yeah, I've never beat it on the Wii, but I have beat it on 360, but it's a pretty easy game, it, it was okay. Um, this game looks a little messed up, I don't know if you can tell or what, but Resident Evil, uh, Wii, uh, Resident Evil 4 Wii Edition. It's a very good game. I got it for twenty dollars. Um nineteen ninety nine, whatever, but yeah, it's a pretty cool game. Um I really enjoyed I really enjoyed playing it. It had decent controls and it was very okay to play. I really I really enjoyed playing with this game. I got this game for twenty five dollars. Pre owned. Um, I got it for my birthday, even though I only had it on PlayStation 2. So, this is the fifth Wii game I have. That is the Simpsons game. Um, it's very fun. Um, definitely should go back and play some more levels, but I have the all 16 episodes. Um, they're really fun, they're really great. I think you should buy this game, but some of the versions are a little bit different. But you know, I, I really like this game. So four, two, three, four, five, five. Now six. I don't have it with me. Uh, eight. Three games I don't have with me. Donkey Kong Country Returns. Used to own it. Well, I was basically renting it, but yeah, it, it's a pretty cool game, but I think I'll buy it by myself. I think you should go and get it. Most of Mario Bros. Wii, I just can't find it. But it, it was a pretty cool game, and definitely great. Bring back the whole Most of Mario Brothers thing. Yeah, a Wii Sports, if you have a Wii, that's the first game you're going to have. Even though, even if you don't play it first, Wii Sports, uh, this pretty, it was pretty okay. I think that's a game you play when you're bored with all your other Wii games. So, ninth game, uh, I got this for twenty dollars used. That is Sonic in the Second Rings. Um. It was a pretty, it's pretty fun controlling Sonic around, and, you know, going through all these different missions, collecting rings and things. You know, it's it's a whole lot of fun. It, it's a whole lot of fun. Definitely say uh, it's worth getting. 
Really scholarship edition. Um, it's a cool game. Yeah, it is really it's cool. It's a cool game. So I can really say about it. Happy birthday, man. Um, so obvious to beat. <laughs> um, no, I used to watch the show a little bit. I wasn't that too much of a fan, but I used to watch the show. And, you know, I decided to pick this up after looking at the review from uh, the Wii viewer. So, yeah, but this game. If you're a fan of Harvey Birdman and you just want to play it just to play it, I say rent it. But if you find it, I don't even think it'll be worth that much. So, you should. This game I hate. Rock and Roll Adventures. Stupid game. I just, I really, I really hate it. It's like Ninja Batman. It's made by the same people who made Ninja Batman. Rock and Roll Adventures is not a cool game. This game I only played once. I got it for my birthday in 09. And that is Showtime Championship Boxing. Um, so yeah, it was a, it was an okay fighting game, but I really don't know my experience with it. Mortal Kombat Armageddon, um, I got it for $20, it's probably cheaper now, but, you know, the controls, I like the racing and I like fighting, but the controls for fighting, they were a little bit hard, but you start to get used to them. Super Mario Galaxy 2, definite game you have to pick up. I got it last year on my birthday. Um, yeah, it's a definite game you have to pick up. Um, it's very beautiful, like how people say it is. It's just a very cool game to get. But sometimes it's not really that easy. But yeah. Let me check something. Looney Tunes at the Arsenal. Looney Tunes at the Arsenal. But this game, I really didn't like it that much. But I might do a walkthrough of it. But I really didn't enjoy playing it. But you know, my friend likes to play it a little bit. I don't know if he still does, but he used to beg me to bring it. So. Oh, one game I have that my god brother is borrowing. It's uh, Just Dance 2. That game, it, it's, pr it's pretty fun and it definitely gives you a workout. This next game, I think it was like, I got it for $35. It came out in August of 2011, August 2nd, I believe. Um, and yeah, it's very short. But... Phineas and Ferb, of course, the second dimension. I don't really even like or watch Phineas and Ferb anymore. Um, I really, I rarely watch it anymore. I sometimes watch it. I, I'm not gonna lie. I sometimes watch it, but it don't really like that because it seems like they did everything. So, but this game is really short. They did it in one day. But, you know, it still is a pretty cool game. I don't know if I'll ever go back to it and do a walkthrough of it. Uh, with my friend, but we'll see in the near future how that goes. SpongeBob SquarePants and the Tools Blobs of Doom. Uh, it's a pretty alright game. Um, I think it's worth renting because it is. Yeah, I think you should rent it for a couple of days. But yeah, I really don't know what to say about it, but it is. Pretty cool. Like, if you're eight, nine, or something, it is pretty cool. Okay, so next game is Michael Jackson The Experience. Um, it was very fun playing this game and doing all the dance moves. I tried to post a video one time of me doing, um, so, so, the way you make me feel. 
Oh, I forgot what happened to it. It was a little copyright copyright thing, so I don't know what happened. But it's very fun playing as Michael Jackson and playing as the dance crew members. Um, you know, it's very fun. If you don't have this game, you definitely need to pick it up. Sorry for the brightness outside. That's the sun. And so the games, I mean the songs are here. Only a Walmart exclusive bonus track. Another part of me uh, is bad. Beat it, Billy Jean, Smooth Criminal Thriller, Black or White. It's like the Earth song, Money. Um, it's some more like some like 80s, 70s stuff. So. Yeah, it's a really fun game. I really think you should get it. I don't know what I make a print so, but whatever. This game, it's another game that I have like this on the Wii. But it's my mom's. But we really don't know what that's at. But last game, we Fit. Um, the games on here were pretty okay. But it's not too much exciting. All I can talk about is the games, really. Because I really don't usually do that stuff like that. But thanks for watching the video. Um, thanks you for watching my videos. And thank you for writing, comment, and subscribing. And I think this is like my 28th video. So I'll see you guys next time. Peace.